Pink yogurt. Before we get into this video, don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell button so you get notified each time we post a new video, like and share this video with your friends and on your social media platforms. Comment down below what videos you would like to see next. So let's get into this video. Mwaka Lindy is an 18 year old girl, a social buzz and I'm an extrovert and I'm a people's person. I am a giver, I have a very warm and big heart. I love charity work and I love giving to my community because it makes me feel at peace and makes me feel. So I am a food junkie. I love food. And my favorite, favorite dish is chihuahua and dry fish. That's my favorite food. We can shimmer. Warm, warm, soft shimmer. And for my dessert, my African dessert is um, sour milk and shimmer with a little bit of sugar. Yeah. I was born on the 6th of January, 2002. I am passionate about disabled children because I believe disability is a matter of perception. And if one child is able to do one thing, then they are needed by the society. One other thing is that I am an advocate for mental health awareness and ending early child marriages. No, not yet. I am not yet in university, but I hope to study public relations and aviation. So, if I'm not doing my duties as Miss Tina Africa Zambia, or not modeling or not doing anything career-wise, I take my time. I pamper myself. And one thing that I love doing the most is going to malls and basking. And I don't bask, eh? I just find people playing guitar and I ask to sing with them because I can't give them the money, so I help them make the money, he gets. So I sing with them for like a few minutes and it also helps me with my stage fights because people are listening to me and are standing there so that helps me and also I take care of my hair, I'm a very natural girl It's a big afro, I have no idea Yeah, so I take care of my hair, I take care of my skin I, My fears, stage fright phobia, yeah I take care of that <laughs> So, this one time eh, I think I was 12 years old in church I would present in church and Bible study. I was very confident. And then this one time I didn't practice my poem. It was a three part poem with a few of us. And then I started this and said the other girl's line and the other girl's line and said thank you. Like the poem was done before my friends could talk and I walked away. And then they all, they all stood there like, oh, what's happening? And then the whole church laughed. That was, oof. I'm never telling this story again. <laughs> Balance my life in a very, very proper way. Everything I like doing, all my hobbies are connected to my modeling career. And I believe if I can sing, I will sing at a pageant, which is combining two in one. So it's like I multitask in one. That's how I juggle my life. My greatest achievement is being Miss Teen Africa. It has been the greatest achievement so far in my life. And I prophesied. I dreamt about it and I got it. <laughs> so I am preparing myself mentally because not only do I advocate about mental health, I also take care of myself mentally. So I am just preparing myself for the outcome, the adventure, and I am trying to stay on a clean diet, you know, <laughs> trying to burn some fat somewhere, and I am just taking my time to absorb everything. I walk 24-7. 24-7. So that's how I'm preparing myself. The recognition. It's the recognition. So little story time. Eh? I was walking to East Park one day and then I was bypassing the bridge and then some guys were like, Maka, Maka, it was so it was so nice, it was so nice. And they were like, keep going, keep pushing hard, you make it. That's my favorite thing about being seen in Africa, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> it feels amazing, honestly. Knowing that people are looking up to you and your story motivates people is a very, very good feeling. So it's very uplifting and it's a lovely, lovely feeling. Comes from the throat, eh? 
hiss. No, it's, the snake is not that large. Yes, because I'm a goat, you know, greatest of all time. When it's crying, sounds like this. No. <laughs> okay, let me bark. This is a big dog, okay? Yeah, I don't like dogs though. That's a pig, right? Yeah. You. Nice. Thank you so much for all your questions. This was part one. We'll try for part two. And the only way you guys will be alerted is if you turn on the bell and subscribe. Thank you.